Hey, I'm Jordi from the YouTube channel Cinecom and welcome to Adobe's Learn from the Pro series. As you know, VFX projects ask for a good team collaboration and multiple reviews from clients, something that I can easily do with Frame.io, a cloud platform made for creators. The extension Frame.io is a tool that works for both Premiere Pro and After Effects, but for this tutorial I'll be showcasing our workflow with After Effects. Frame.io is now part of Adobe, that means you can access it immediately from within After Effects or Premiere Pro. To do that, simply go Go to the menu on top, choose Window, and then find Review with Frame.io. Now it's going to ask you to log in, and if you haven't got an account yet, just create one. Now with an Adobe subscription, you can use Frame.io up to two users, but you don't actually need After Effects or Premiere to use Frame.io. With the web application, you can also use all the functionalities of the extension. This is very useful for clients or teammates who don't have the Adobe suite. And with a free account, it is super easy to add notes and reviews. So once my account is set up, I'll have access to Frame.io and After Effects. In the dedicated panel, I can see the different options. Now, the whole idea behind Frame.io is to collaborate by transferring your project, allowing for a cloud production workflow. At the same time, you can use Frame.io as a cloud storage. So there are a lot of possibilities from individuals all the way up to large teams for big productions. But what I find super useful using Frame.io is to get feedback and approval from clients. So I have a composition with a first rough via VIX shot. To send this over to our client, for notes and feedback, I first need to upload it. So in the Frame.io panel on top, I can find the upload button and from here we get some options. I can upload the active comp, files from inside After Effects and even the entire project file. Now that last one is super handy if you want a colleague to continue working on that project, but also if you want to send it to another workstation. This makes sharing super easy. But for our client's revision, I will only need to send over them the active comp. So I choose that option. For the next steps, I need to choose multiple settings and how I want to share the composition, like the name, which video preset that I want to use, and so on. They are quite self-explanatory. So just choose how you want to share your work. Frame.io will then process your composition. And now I can easily share this comp with clients and colleagues to ask for feedback. If you want to add a collaborator and user, you can simply hit this button right here, and it will email them an invite. I just added my teammate, Janik. He can now immediately work on the same project. Now for a client who only needs to review the VFX shot, I can do it differently. I just have to hit the share button right here and pick share for review. This will give me a link which I can send over to my clients. This way I can get feedback from externals without having to add them as a user. And now there are many different tools that our clients can use to give feedback. First we have the normal comment input. The timecode matches accurately with the timeline in After Effects so they can leave their thoughts right here. But they can also draw and add annotations like lines, circles, arrows, and so on. This will help to better explain what they have in mind. And thus you're eliminating that you're going back and forward so many times. If the client is done, they just need to set the edit status as needs review, which can be done from here. All of their feedback is being updated instantly to my project. I can see all their notes in my project, and if I click on them, my playhead will automatically jump to that exact part in the composition. This makes adjustments really easy. Now, if I double click on any of the comments, I can see the entire conversation and easily add a reply. Or when I completed an adjustment, I can mark it as completed. But now, what if I want to work offline later on? Well, I can create markers from all the feedback notes. I just have to go to my comments list and import the comments. And this will create a new layer with the feedback and annotations on the correct spot in my composition. And when I'm done with all of my revisions, I can go through the same process as before and upload my active comp. And to make this even more organized, I enable the auto version option when uploading my new comp. This will stack your revisions and will keep the project clean. Next, I will again send my clients a review link and if they like everything, they just have to approve the project by changing the status. And that is how you can use Frame.io to get fast client reviews and approval, but also work very organized and streamlined in a team. Definitely check out the other tutorials and the Adobe's Learn from the Pros playlist. And as always, stay creative.